today I will just be taking you guys on with the rest of my day. It's currently like 2.30 maybe. And I just got finished with school because I have exams week this week. But tomorrow I have like a little trial for an assessment I'm doing. So yeah. So I don't have to study for anything tomorrow. It's just going to be my teachers explaining basically what the assessment's about and some surveys that I have to answer, but nothing that I have to study for. So the rest of the day, I'm really just chilling. I just get two days off of exams, which honestly is super cool because I've never had that before ever. Um, but yeah, this time I get two days off, so I only have three days of actual exams. So that's fun. That's really nice. Okay, so basically I just got some cereal because I was hungry. And if I didn't get myself food, I would not be very happy. So, I got myself some food. Yeah. Oh, my bed is messy. Okay, so now I'm done. And I'm putting a bunch of these crystal things inside of this wooden box. Um, I don't think these are real. I don't know if it's real or not. Um... So don't come for me, say I'm bragging or whatever. I'm really, I'm not, I really am not. I'm just showing you guys something that I, I'm doing. Basically, for the whole point of this video, which is showing my day. I have uh, three things of this, so it's 144 pieces. I'm not gonna do that. I'm just down. Putting the stuff back into the container because why? Where else should we put them, right? Put it back in the box where I found it. And again, sorry for the loud banging upstairs. There's some Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna put it in here. Right there. It's done. I have some sweet pea perfume. Oh, I love the smell. I don't have to use it for my. I don't use perfume that much. I use um Bath and Body Works vanilla. The it smells like vanilla. Anyways. probably don't because if you do then that's weird um i got it from my aunt she went to the states i mean a few years ago and got it for new year's or something and got it from my mom actually my mom never uses it so i stole it well i didn't steal it it's family so technically you can't really steal you guys later okay so it's already nighttime and so now I'm going to actually make my make my bed because it's really really messy and we don't want that he's chilling but I'm not I'm freaking out because it's really messy so I'm gonna put you guys here. and I'm gonna make my bed actually clean out I'm gonna bl blur that out anyways I'm gonna clean my side table because it's really really messy and I'll get back okay so I have finally cleaned up like picked up my room so beds all made side table is good we're good um 
yeah i don't i really don't know what to say anymore but we're gonna continue on the vlog because we're not gonna make this a freaking two minute vlog i don't even know how many minutes i haven't edited any of this <sighs> can we take a second to like appreciate people who like as a fan page but like edit like their pictures or videos as in like their daily post I could net like I tried doing that with Suni. I still love her, by the way. Here's my, here's my favorite picture right there. Oh my gosh, I am so incredibly proud of her. I let's just take you know what we're gonna switch off. Let's take this segment to like appreciate a little bit. You know, Suni is crazy. She's she's like she has gone through so much. And yet she still, like, comes out, like, first. Like, that's crazy. Honestly, to me, all right, um, I'm a very competitive person. Very competitive person. Um, I don't like losing. Who does? I mean, yeah. I have that in my blood. I'm gonna sit because, yeah. Anyways, who likes losing? No, not really anyone. So, yes, but like, Suni not only like, not only got into the Olympics, but freaking won first overall on the all around gymnastics competition. That's crazy. I'm, I'm so obsessed with her. She's still my huge inspiration. But, yeah. I just okay the reason why i'm not i didn't if you know my suni account good for you but if you don't then it's totally okay but yeah i um i'm not gonna link it because i quit i quit not because i don't like suni anymore or i don't support her as much as i did when i had the fan page no it's because she is such an incredible person and i'm i Every time I make an edit, I constantly feel like the edits that I made are not good enough. Because I'm not very good at editing. I'm pretty bad. So I want to, like, get better at editing. And then maybe one day if I'm really good at editing, which probably won't happen. But if that day does happen, then I might come back to that soon account. But I'm not going to link it still. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. But yeah, though, people who make edits daily, my respect goes to you. Like, literally, I could never, I can't do it. Because to me, even, um, I'm a small creator on TikTok. Not at all big. Like, when people make edits, it's just so... It's, it's, it's a good feeling. It's a really good feeling. It's so, so grateful to have the people I do on my TikTok or on my, yeah, on my account. There's just people that are just so nice. They're so supportive of everything. And they're just so, so, so great. They're amazing. Yeah, it's really good to have it. I'm really grateful for it. That's all I can say. I am lost for words. I don't even know what to say. I'm embarrassing myself. I would like to apologize in advance if this video is very boring or cringy. Because I don't know. I'm sorry. I don't know. I, I, um, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I'm scared. You know, I'm not gonna lie, sometimes I wonder, why do people call me Mini Dixie, you know? Like, what did I have to give? What what, what did I do so good? So Dixie's amazing. Um, and I also think about it. I literally am the miniature version of Dixie, because <laughs> I do what she does without knowing it. <gasps> Look, I'm trying to get out a picture of my dog when I first got him. It's in a frame, but... Look, it's just a little puppy. 
Hold on, I'll get him. And then I'll compare the pictures. He's really tired. This is actually him. It's not like some Pinterest dog. Here, look. Here, this is Milo. And this is Milo. Alright, let's do a little how I, I got Milo <laughs> a story. Um, basically, it was my birthday. And... Um, okay, I'm sorry. And I really, really, really wanted a dog. But I really had no hope because my mom doesn't really like dogs. Um, well, as she said before. But, well, then I went well, on my birthday. My mom gave me the picture. Sir, I'm sorry. Um, gave me the picture frame and a little thing. Hold up, like up there. Yeah, my mom loves doing these stuff for like anyone, literally. My mom's secretary made this. Anyway, it's just a little like happy birthday, and then it on like there's like the, there's a picture of him on the cake. Um, <laughs> I don't know why she loves doing this, but she does. Anyways, sh and then on the cake it says like, "Will you pick me up tomorrow?" And I was like, I was honestly like shook. I was confused. Like, did she like? I don't know. I. I Honestly, I didn't know if she actually got the dog for me or it was like I could play with the dog. But then it said pick me up, so I was like, I, 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 I'm getting a dog right now. And behind it is just a little thing of a Milo. And of course, my mom had to add her little thing. I love everything clean because my mom is a clean freak. Literally, the whole family knows that. Anyways, that's all for today's video. I'm sorry if it's boring again, but the next video, hopefully it will be much more eventful and fun. But yeah, bye guys. Hope you have a nice day and stay safe.